guys, my name is Stephen Beecham, and here's what's happening this week on CNET's Crave Blog. The Storm e-bike is taking Indiegogo by storm with its very cheap early bird price of $4.99. Get it while the getting is good because that price will rise to $5.99 on February 6th and will eventually retail at $12.99 when it comes to market. The Storm e-bike has a 350 watt motor and can reach speeds of 20 miles per hour with a range of 30 to 50 miles. The battery fully charges in 90 minutes and it comes equipped with these awesome large knobby tires for off-roading. Check it out at Indiegogo.com. This book cover is judging you. And if it determines you are judging it with a silly look on your stupid face, it will not let you read it. The cover that judges you is an experiment by Thea's Bierstecker of Amsterdam-based creative agency Moore and was designed to fit over other books. The book has a built-in camera with facial recognition software and an Arduino board connected to an arm that keeps the book locked. If it likes the look on your face, it will open for and you. Don't touch the book by its cover. And then the little Arduino powered lock open. See that? If it doesn't like your face, it will remain locked. So obviously the message here is don't judge a book by its cover. And if I'm overexcited, it won't let me in. This USB thumb drive is literally a USB thumb drive. Canadian photographer Justin Paulson made the thumb drives as part of a promotional mailer for his creative skills that contained a message suggesting that Paulson can help make clients stick out like a sore thumb. Well, he got Crave's attention. Paulson used a mold of his own thumb and embedded working USB drives into them, finishing off each drive with a careful and creepy paint job that is very realistic. Make sure you check out Crave's photo gallery of the thumb drives. NASA's administrator Charles Bolden said Monday that the space agency is planning a mission to Jupiter's ice-covered moon Europa, which could depart in the early 2020s. In his annual State of NASA address, Bolden said, Looking to the future, we're planning a mission to explore Jupiter's fascinating moon Europa, selecting instruments this spring and moving toward the next phase of our work. Europa is being targeted because scientists believe that under the icy shell of its surface lies a massive ocean, which could lead us to discovering the building blocks for life, much like the Curiosity rover did on Mars recently. NASA has been testing a mission concept called the Europa Clipper, currently under development by the Jet Propulsion Laboratory. The Europa Clipper would be sent into orbit around Jupiter on a path that would allow it to fly close to Europa, using scientific instruments to determine if the hidden ocean might be an environment that could host life. Guys, that's the show. Thank you very much for watching. As always, you can find all these news stories at CNET's Crave blog at crave.cnet.com. Make sure you follow Crave on Twitter at Crave and check out this week's Crave giveaway. This week's Crave giveaway, we have a pair of A Audio Icon Wireless Bluetooth headphones. A luxury pair of headphones from A Audio. Go to the blog and enter to win.